We are SEED, a national network led by Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander young people, standing up in our communities for climate justice. And we have just taken on our most ambitious project to date. A huge Queensland road trip from Townsville to Brisbane with young SEED representatives from all over Australia. Collecting stories from Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander mobs who are witnessing and being affected by climate change in the state which will continue to feel the worst impacts here in Australia. Our communities are less adapted to deal with the impacts of climate change and that's why as young people that are city based, that you know, they have the education we need to stand up and speak for our mob and get our mob connected on this issue because it really is going to affect us. This was all pristine country and the little bit of pristineness that's still here we'd like to keep. We are fighting to prevent the Gully Basin from being opened up, which is one of the largest coal reserves in the world. And we will continue to work to stop the expansion of the Abbott Point coal port on the Great Barrier Reef. This is where we talk about going beyond climate impacts and our mob should not have to sign agreements with any government or any mining company if they don't want their land destroyed. This uh, must that damage all the money in the world and never buy, get them back. We know the huge social injustice that fossil fuel extraction is causing to Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander peoples in Queensland, as well as the irreversible damage to our sacred country. We, we don't exist as people without our culture and the soul and the spirit that connects us to the land. If the land is poisoned, then so are we. And the land is our mother. You don't do that. We need you like, like we've never needed young people to work for the land in Australia before because we have not done it. That's a big job you kids are going to be doing and I'm so grateful that you are there because you are going to be carrying it on when we're all gone. As young people we know we cannot sit by. We must rise to this challenge. Sign our declaration and be a part of making climate justice a reality for our people.